What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings 1010, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of. Or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangels, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current karmic <clears throat> energy for the collective. Please give me clear, accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me on the channel. I appreciate you. I appreciate you for all the love and the support. All right, you guys. Let's get into the current karmic energy for you guys. All right. So, we have a person that has bad habits. This person's soul could be crying out for help at this time. This could be somebody that's very lazy. All right? Mattress back. This person is only known for laying on their back and shit. All right? This person could be a spiritual hater as well. All right? So, we're going to get into this person. All right? Let's see, y'all. This current karmic energy that's crying out for help. All right? <clears throat> let's see all right this is a spiritual hater a hate hating ass motherfucker this person could be trying to be like you too because behind this car it was copycat okay so yeah let's see this is giving me the energy of if you can't beat them join them kind of energy <laughs> all right this is giving me that kind of vibe all right, let's see. All right, let's see. Current karmic energy for the collective. What is this about, spirit? Who is this person? Let's talk about it. All right, king of cups. All right, so this could have been a person you trusted at a point in time to give you some kind of knowledge on the situation. This person could have came off very um, emotionally stable at a point in time okay but this person really had like a you know a mental imbalance okay this guy has something to do with a pisces or a gemini okay let's see nine of pentacles empress this current energy okay we got six of swords eight of cups bottom of the deck we got ten of pentacles all right so i'm seeing that this current karmic energy could be first of all this person could be seeing that you could be very successful you could be moving forward in your situation and you could be really accumulating a lot or you're about to accumulate a lot all right because you could have sacrificed this person but i feel like for a lot of you guys you could have trusted this person at a point in time to give you some kind of knowledge on the situation you could have thought that this person was very knowledgeable about about some shit but i'm i'm feeling that this person is like very um this is like a very trickery kind of kind of vibe kind of energy kind of person okay i feel like that this person could have tried to give you some kind of advice when it came to your money or something like that on how to move forward and shit like that but i feel like you guys could have emotionally walked away withdrew from it because you could have you could have been looking for the truth in a situation and you could have found it. For some of y'all, you figured out that this person was a fraud. Okay? All right? You could have figured out that this person was just a fraud kind of vibe. Like, you know what I'm saying? That they weren't true. Okay? This could be a person that really know how to wear a mask. Like, this person know how to wear a mask, yo. Like, they they are professional at wearing masks. Okay? This, this particular individual okay you got strong virgo energy out here okay we got strong pisces too and taurus and we have aquarius okay yeah distance horizons is in the reverse okay false person so this person could live close to you for some of you guys or this person could have traveled very close to where you live or something like that okay this is a false person that you thought that knew what the fuck that they was talking about. Okay. 
But I feel like for some of you guys, divine, your ancestors of your highest good could have given you some sacred knowledge, okay, on how to get your own money, <laughs> okay, or you are about to get it. And I feel like you guys could have been starting to really accumulate in a situation or you're about to. Because for some of you guys, this person that tried to give you some kind of advice, listen, it wasn't going to get you nowhere. Okay, it was going to get you in a tough situation. You was going to be fucked up, okay? For some of y'all, you could have realized that and was like, I ain't fucking with you. You know, and divine, your ancestors of your highest good, you could have gotten some sacred knowledge. Like, nah, this person don't know what the fuck they talking about. For real. All right, this person a fucking fraud. That's what, <laughs> that's what some of y'all was saying. Like, this person a fucking fraud. For some of y'all, you could have considered this person a good friend at a point in time. Okay, but mm -mm. <laughs> like hell no, nah. hell yeah, this card just flew out because this person could have been high in some shit that they was doing to you. Okay, for some of y'all, this person had hidden intentions on what that they was doing with you. They had hidden intentions. Okay, this person could have wanted you to get into something that was going to ruin your whole destiny here. That was meant for you, okay? This person could have wanted you to agree to do something with them, okay? For some of y'all, if you would have did this with this person, this would have sacrificed your whole destiny. Like, you would have sacrificed your whole, like, destiny, your ancestral everything if you would have agreed to what this person was trying to tell you to do, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm seeing here. Okay, clarify King of Cups. Clarify King of Cups. Yeah, Page of Swords. Exactly. Magician. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, this was nothing but manipulation to try to get you to do some fuck shit. Okay? I feel like you guys was forced to do some shadow work too because this person wanted you bound to them. Okay, they wanted you bound to them. I feel like some of you guys was led to go within. Okay, for a lot of you guys, you was really led to go within this situation. Okay, for some of you guys, you would have lost out on a lot of money, a lot of time. Okay, like for some of y'all, you may have even winded up in jail or winded up in a very in a very very fucked up situation if you would have listened to this person's advice okay this is giving me an energy of somebody just wanting to like destroy you in a sneaky ass way okay but for a lot of you guys you was ahead of the game when it came to this person clarify nine of pentacles clarify nine of pentacles All right, Knight of Pentacles. Yep, Queen of Pentacles. Yep, I feel like that this person was trying to really like present you with an offer. For some of you guys, you could have been like, damn, like, what the hell? Like, is this really, is this really good or something like that? Like, it could have, this person could have made it sound real, real good. Okay, in a situation. But for some of you guys, you would have had to like go against uh something that you know something that is true to you you would have had to go against it in order to get this okay with this person i feel like for some of you guys this person wasn't going to admit this to you until you signed the contract that's what i'm hearing until you signed the contract all right clarify empress clarify empress Yep, chariot. Exactly. You see this chariot card? Do it look like this person is moving forward? No. Okay. <laughs> yeah, queen of cups. I feel like you guys are very intuitive. And I feel like for some of you guys, this person was trying to force you, trying to come to you with soft ass energy. Like, oh, yeah, we could do this. Yeah. 
But for some of you guys, you knew the storm that was coming. You knew that, okay, this is a storm that could potentially fuck me up. You know what I'm saying? And then this person was like waiting. Like waiting for their manipulation tactics to work on you. Okay? All right? For some people, this person could have wanted to like act like they wanted to date you or some shit. All right? For some of you guys... Every time this person would come over your house, they would try to talk to you about it. Or every time they came around you, they tried to talk to you about it. Okay? Like, they tried to, like, you know, convince you to do something or something like that. And for some of y'all, you was very standoffish. You was like, I don't know, man. Yeah, that sounds good, but I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Clarify Six of Swords. Exactly. Death card. Page of Pentacles. All right. For some of you guys, this could have been some kind of um, overseas or out of town kind of thing. But this person was trying to lure you into this so they can end you. Okay. This person may have tried to lure, is trying to lure you into a contract without you knowing that they trying to do it. So this person could have felt like that they could get you caught up in a situation to where you didn't know what you were signing. Okay? Yeah, this person felt like that you wasn't paying attention or this could be what I am foreseeing. Okay? This could be something coming towards somebody too. Okay? Yeah. I feel like this person wants your healing process to end. Because for some of you guys, as you heal, you really elevate in your energy. And when you elevate in your energy, everything else elevates. Your money, your, your looks, your health, everything elevates around you. As you elevate spiritually, I mean, you don't even have to say that you are um, healing. I mean, it shows on the outside. You know what I'm saying? And I'm seeing that somebody wanted to end your healing. Because a lot of you guys could really be overcoming hardship of constantly being disappointed when it comes to dumbass motherfuckers like this. But this could be somebody that, you know, they could see something in you, some, something in you that they see, okay? And I feel like that this person felt like that, okay, if I do it like this, maybe I can get them to agree, is what I'm hearing. If I do it like this, maybe they'll agree. If I say it like this, maybe they will agree, okay? Somebody could have tried to really play on your emotions, like act like they gave a fuck about you. And this person was really just trying to lure you in to some bullshit. Okay? I'm just letting y'all know. But Divine say hell no. Okay? For some of you guys, you could have listened to, you know, what Divine was saying. Okay? Yeah, you could have really listened to what Divine was saying when it came to you. All right? Clarify Eight of Cups or you will, okay? All right, exactly. Page of Pentacles. This is giving me like trickster energy. <laughs> All right? Yeah, we got Hermit. We got this King of Wands. And we have Empress. Bottom of the deck, Judgment. Exactly. I feel like for some of you guys, this person felt like that you wasn't paying attention. But I feel like some of you guys was led to go within because you could be high priestess, high priest. You could be very in tune and you was led to go within. And I feel like you could have had a very um, loving spirit come in and give you some kind of knowledge on how to heal your business. Okay. Or how to heal your financial situation. And I feel like for a lot of you guys, you did it by yourself. You didn't even need nobody. You did it by yourself. Or you will do it by yourself. You're going to decide to do it by yourself. All right? Yeah. Judgment. And that's what happened here. This could be a spiritual hater that just not a crying out for help. And trying to be like you because it's like they couldn't beat you. They couldn't get you to join this. They couldn't get you to sign this contract. They couldn't like 
um, play on you to try to get you to sign something. Or this is what's coming towards you. For some people, somebody is going to use, not for everybody, but somebody is going to use somebody you know to try to get you to sign something. Somebody that could be very close to you. If this person knows somebody that's really, really close to you, they may use this person to make you sign something. And then you know what's going to happen? Your abundance and everything is going to slow down. Everything is going to slow down. Stuff going to stop. It's going to stop moving forward. You're going to start seeing like a bunch of stagnation in your energy. For some of you guys, if you agree to this and this is happening to you now, I feel like that. You know, listen, this is some deep shit. I feel like divine could have nudged you to go within before you even did this shit for some people. Okay. But I'm seeing that this person, whoever this is, they don't live far from you or they could travel. They travel like where you live. You know, they have traveled where you live or they are about to travel where you live. Okay. Or something like that. Okay. This is a false person. Definitely. Okay. So, like I said, we got strong Virgo energy. Strong Virgo. And then we got Aries, Libra, Taurus, Capricorn, Scorpio, Cancer, Gemini. Okay. Yeah. Mental health issues. And we have Scorpio. Okay. And up here, we have Pisces, Virgo, Taurus, Aquarius, Okay, strong Pisces and Virgo. All right. Yeah. Cashier. Chains. 30s. Right arm tattoos. Doctor. Big butt. Lip gloss. Brown skin tone. Pregnant, long eyelashes, real or fake, and separated. Leo, white liquor, clear liquor, accent, lip piercing, hoodie lover. We have Chevy and sports. Stay at home mom. 60s, dimples, colored hair, lazy and printed tops, Chrysler, tongue piercing, colorful nails, model, high cheekbones, five kids or less, Divine Bean, Workaholic and Natural Hair. Somebody can have a nice watch or an Apple Watch. Somebody flight. We got a small chest. 20s. Somebody could be six feet and up. We have Chevy. Pills. And we have dresses. Okay. Right. That's what I'm seeing here. Crazy, huh, y'all? They be really on that shit. For real. So we have A, we have Cancer, Aquarius, something with um Garcia, somebody can have a Jaguar, okay, somebody could be a senior.
All right. Gemini. Okay. Also, somebody could be on the DL. Okay. Something with Jari. Jari. 67, 62. 26, 27, 72, 76. February 2nd, February 7th, February 6th, June 6th, June 2nd, June 7th, July 7th, July 2nd, July 6th. Okay. Something with Deja. Somebody name could be H-A-S. Okay. Something with Rio. Somebody can have red hair or their favorite color is red. Their car is red. Okay. That's some shit. Somebody name could be L-A-R. Okay. Somebody name could be S-A-R. I'm hearing Erica. Something with Aranique, okay? Okay. Something with Ebony, I'm hearing. Ebony. Okay. Somebody can have Parkinson's disease. Something with Parkinson's disease, I'm just hearing that. Something with CJ, PJ. Okay. Somebody name could be R A S. All right. Somebody name could be D A L, D A S, D A W, D A R. Something with Jarisha. Okay, Jarisha. All right. Something with Diablo. All right. So just because I said your name, this could be somebody around you and your energy. It don't have to be you. Okay. So what I'm seeing here for some of y'all, this could have something to do with a friend. Okay. For some of y'all, this your children. Okay. Family member, co-worker. All right. Just only apply what fit for you. Do not apply shit that don't fit. That's how people get confused. Okay. Every message is not going to be for you. All right. Even if I say your name, every mess, even if I say your sign, every message is not going to be for you. OK, it's a lot of other Tauruses out here. It's a lot of other Gemini's out here. It's a lot of other Aquarius is out here. OK, you're not the only one. All right. All right, you guys, I'm hearing Dion as well. Dion. All right, you guys like comment and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.